Hey guys, Ivan here at ivanmana.com, and in this video, I want to show you how to upload your ads.txt file to your WordPress website. You would want to do this if you want to monetize your website via AdSense or Media.net or any other such monetizing website. So let's get straight into it. If you recall, we built out our WordPress website through A2 Hosting. Check that video out above if you haven't seen it yet. But what you have to do is access the cPanel of whatever uh, hosting provider you used, whether it's HostGator or A2 Hosting or whatever it is. So access the cPanel and in here we have to find our file manager. And in this file manager, we're gonna add this text file, okay? So our file manager just so happens to be at the top here, but if you're using a cPanel and you're not sure where it is, just type in file manager in the search bar, should be somewhere and you'll It'll, it'll come up for you as well. So once you're in this file directory, this is everything, uh, you know, these are all your website uh, file directories. You can edit them and all that. And we're gonna add the file here. So we're gonna select public HTML. And now we have two options to add this ads.txt file to. We can either upload the file, which in our case is this one right here. So it's our uh, ads.txt file, or uh, we can add a blank kind of notepad and we can simply copy and paste okay so if we upload it it's as simple as that we're going to choose the file so we're going to select the file we're going to select add uh, ads.txt uh, just give it a second to make sure that everything is good here and then we'll go back so once it's at 100 percent and green we know it's here and if we open this now just to double check, we see that it's here, okay? So that's one of the ways you can do it. The other way, which uh, really is pretty much the same thing, we're gonna add a file. We can name it ads2.txt, right? Just as an example, we'll create new file. And now we have it here. Now what we're gonna do is we can edit this. Skip that, just click edit. We're gonna head back here. We're gonna copy all of this and we're gonna paste it there. So I did control V and then we'll click save changes and then we can close. Okay, and now this one should be good to go as well. So let's go ahead and open that one just to test. And then here we see it all here as well. Uh, it says zero bytes here, it's not ready yet. Now the way you can check this to make sure it is there, um, because once you go back into AdSense or once you go back into MediaNet or whatever platform you're using to monetize your website, uh, you will have to kind of they will confirm and make sure that your site is there. If you want to make sure it's there, what you're gonna do is open your website. So we're gonna, let's copy the site. I'm gonna control C, I'm gonna open a new window. And then what you're gonna do is hit slash, and then you'll say the name of whatever file you added here, which is for example, ads.txt or ads2.txt. So we'll click ads.txt, we'll click next. And there you go, okay, we have the file here. Now this isn't secure, even though our website is. So if we type in HTTPS, it should pull up the same thing, but now it is secure, okay? And there you go, that's how you add the ads.txt file to your website so you can start monetizing it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Check out my other WordPress playlist where I teach you how to install it and how to add Thrive Theme so that you can build high converting landing pages on your WordPress website. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video.